Hi guys, welcome to my channel, Brandy Plans. Today we're doing the pre-plan in my kids question journal. Um, this is my 52 weeks of gnomes journal. I'm using this amazing gardening uh, gnome kit from Caffeine Queens. I love their kits. I love their kits and I especially love their gnome kits. Um, yeah, I just think they're so fun and I've gotten so many of them that I'm starting to like get quite used to the like design and pattern and so yeah, I like they've become almost a staple in this planner. So yeah, um, it'll be interesting next year because I have big plans to change up the planner next year. I'm going to do um, 52 weeks of fandom. So like I'm yeah, it'll be very interesting, but that's kind of my, like, plan is to do that. And it's not my kids' fandom. It's my fandom. So I know that sounds silly, but, like, I don't care. It's, it's my, they're my planners. So, like, <laughs> I get to pick what I want. Um, but, yeah, so I always start off, I, I write the question that I ask them at the top of the page, and then I write their responses in three boxes underneath. That's the general gist. On the sidebar, I always put three three sections. Sometimes I like put things in there. Sometimes I just leave them blank. I don't really worry about that too much um, because, again, I don't want to like planning supposed to be a hobby and entertaining for me, and I don't want to have to stress out about it. I shouldn't. You should never stress about using your planners. Do you know what I mean? Like it that makes the hobby no longer entertaining and or fun. So I don't ever want to feel like I'm like bothered by them or that they're like like a chore, I guess is the best way to say it. I don't want to ever feel like planning is a chore because then that takes the joy out of it. So yeah. So that's kind of where I'm at in regards to my planners. But I really, really love this planner. I love gnomes, as you guys know. So the fact that I'm doing 52 weeks in gnomes and like looking back is so fun. It's just, yeah, it's super fun. I'm really, really enjoying it. So yeah, so I've been enjoying that. I hope you guys are having a great week. This is, of course, the week of Father's Day. I did do a Father's Day kit in my main planner, but I didn't in my other planners. Um... I only, yeah, I don't even really do a Mother's Day kit in my planner. I do a kit that I love because it's Mother's Day. So I usually do a fandom for me kit for Mother's Day or like something that really brings me joy. So I would definitely say that like, yeah, I'm not huge on like the Mother's Day, Father's Day. We definitely celebrate. And I took my husband out. I got the date wrong. I talk a lot about that in another plan with me, but yeah, I did get the date wrong. So I definitely have to remember to like celebrate for my dad and my brother and all them coming up. Um, but yeah, so my kids are almost, we're winding down school. It's near the end of the school year. So we have to like get, get things organized. My kids are already like going to be bringing school supplies and stuff home. So I have to organize all that to get it ready for like next year. Um, my son starts exam schedule coming up soon. So I have to know like when he's off because he only has half days when he does his exam. So I have to actually make sure that like someone's there to pick him up and like all that kind of jazz. So, um, I have to like put his schedule, like his, um, what am I trying, his exam schedule in my like thing and actually plan it because we're planners. So we should actually like plan it and put it in my planner. <laughs> that's the whole point of why we do this, right? Wink, wink, right? Is to actually plan. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, wink, wink. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder if I'm like, I just plan just to put stickers on paper and they're pretty and they make me happy. When I'm like, I actually need to actually plan stuff. Like I actually have to have a thing. And I actually, I've been thinking a lot about next year's planners already. And it's not even halfway through this year. But I already love like the thought process of next year's. I'm going to add a fourth planner. However, um, I'm going to I'm gonna decorate the whole year at once. I know, right? I know. And it's going to be my carry all forward planner. Um, so I've been thinking really hard and I think I really want to do that. So that's going to be coming up. I'm not sure if you guys want to watch like a whole setup because it's going to take me a long time. I would like, yeah, I would think it would take a long time. I hope it takes a long time. Um, but I really want to use like leftover stickers and like a lot of my happy planner stuff because I have tons of happy planner sticker books and I really want to like start using them. 
um, because I don't want to like have these beautiful stickers go to waste. So that's kind of my plan. And I've always wanted to have like a paper planner in my purse. Um, but like I, I hated like planning like the week ahead, but I was like trying to write something like two months ahead. Does that make sense? And I don't, I don't want to just put a sticky note and then plan it. Like I actually want it to look pretty right off the hop and I want it to have stickers. So that's kind of my game plan. Um, so stay tuned for that. That's going to be coming up soon. Um, as you guys know, the plan sale is coming up this weekend and Pinnacle Sticker Co. is in it. So definitely go check out that. And there's a ton of other amazing shops in that. Um, like I have big plans to buy from a bunch of the other shops as well. Like Tiny Little Tulip is in it and Avalon and Ninth is in it. And there's just, there's tons of great shops so definitely check that out um there's also like there's always like fun sales happening so definitely go check out your favorite local sticker shops and just kind of like give them a little love because I know like everybody's kind of watching their dollars so it's good to send them love and as always thank you for sticking around and hanging out with me bye guys